Today I'm going to show you a cool trick that you can do on your Ultimaker 3. Uh, it involves a tiny little bit of coding, um, it's just a little bit of fun, um, but it allows you to change the colour of the LEDs. I'll show you how to do that now. So the first thing we're going to need to do is save our file as a G-code and then open that G-code in a text editor. This will show you um, the, the coding for that file and you want to look for this line here which says generated with Cura Steam Engine and then insert another line underneath there and insert the following piece of code. Um, it's important that the M at the start is a capital and then the R, G and B are all, and W are all in lower case. Um, and then you can see there's three numbers next to each of these letters. And basically 255 is full on for that colour. So, so if we wanted to make it green, for example, we put 255 next to the G and zeros for all the others. And this will make our lights turn green. And likewise for the other colours. So R is red, B is blue and W is white. Once you've done that, we need to save again um, and just ensure that the end of the file has .g code on it. And then once you load it into your uh, Ultimaker 3, and select print, it should change colour. Okay, so that's our Ultimaker 3 all set up um, with the green lights. You can obviously do it in a few other colours if you want to experiment with that. Um, but yeah, as we say, it's just a, just a fun little um, thing you can play around with. Um, let us know if you have any sort of questions about doing it. And uh, if you want to buy an Ultimaker 3, you can do so by following the link here. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment and subscribe. Also, come follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. You can find out more about our products and services by visiting dream3d.co.uk.